Hey, this is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it indeed. How are you doing out there in YouTube land? This is your girl, Saida, the domestic handmaiden of distinction, coming again as always to you live and direct. I am so excited today to be bringing you this two in one video it's been long long overdue and i do apologize for it being so late but we are coming today with one of my uh t videos and i'm going to be naming this uh series what's in my cup tea party so it's going to be a tea party uh, i'm going to be coming probably daily weekly monthly however the spirit leads with different uh or various ways that i'll be preparing the teas and enjoying them. So I hope that you enjoy this uh, series and walk along with me. If you have any requests for any tea that you'd like to see, please don't hesitate to leave it in the comments section or you can look in the about section and get uh, my um, contact information and send it privately if you need to or want to. So I'm going to be featuring various teas and today, 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 <laughs> Today we'll be featuring the rose blooming um, tea. Let's see if it'll show up here. The rose flowering tea. Now I'm not. Uh, we're going to be doing this together. Uh, this is a, a Simpson and Vale tea. We're going to be doing this together. So I'm not sure how it's going to uh, pan out, but we're going to work on it together and. Um, see how things go you see I have my little haiku lotion in here although it's a peony violet uh, fragrance it smells like roses and I have my uh, agraria cedar rose uh, fragrant um, uh, fragrance out here so um, yeah so I have already um, prepared this I hope I have anyway I've put some a little hot water in it and let it steep for a little minute so that it can just get warm. Um, I did that a few minutes ago. I have a little snack here. All I have here is some apples drizzled in uh, chocolate powder as well as um, well, sprinkled in chocolate powder and drizzled in some chocolate. And then I have some wheat crackers with uh, cashew butter and cream cheese on top of it. So that is what we'll be enjoying. And the um, honey that we'll be using today is uh, from Thrifty Bee. I think I picked this up at a at a Mariano's or somewhere. I can't remember, but it was so, it was cute. <laughs> the little container was cute and, and it was all that I was ready to spend that day. So I just picked that up. I just thought that little container was cute anyway. So yeah, I'm going to, uh, without further ado, let us get started. Um, and I want to thank everybody who, uh, you know, is always requesting the video, the tea videos and who, um, you know, is always su uh, supportive of the tea videos. So again, it's uh, Simpson and Vale. You probably saw, uh, if you didn't, I'll try to link the video that I did my unboxing for my Simpson and Vale. Uh, teas. Um, they're quality teas and coffees uh, since 1929. And again, this is the rose flowering tea. And as you can see, this is what it looks like. It is, uh, you have to, you can do your own research on it, but it is a, a variety of, I guess, green teas. And it has been bundled together and sewn. This is a, a piece of a uh, rope uh, not rope but like a threading that they use and this is uh supposed to flower so let us see what it does i'm going to put it down for now <clears throat> and i'm going to move this out of the way because i'm going to use this as um <clears throat> the steeper of course the saucer i'm going to use it to to place upon it so i'm going to put my water in first I don't know if I should put, I think I'm going to put my water in first. I have my little carafe here. I'm going to put my water in first. It's good and hot. Like I said, I already tempered this, although I wish I had another glass. I already tempered it. 
put some uh, water in it earlier and let it just sit for a few minutes to get it nice and hot. So that should be enough. Now let us place it in. Uh oh, <laughs> and now I'm just going to place the top on it and and we're going to see I don't know I might need to speed this up I might have to try to edit it some type of way but you know that's not my way because I'm alive and direct <laughs> but let us see how long it takes us uh, to to actually flower yeah so I hope everybody is doing pretty good out there I am doing pretty good myself just uh, busy and whatnot of course like everybody else so I'm going to uh, <clears throat> be doing working in my planner today <clears throat> and getting some um, much needed office work uh, done yeah so yeah well let me take a bite of my apple or a snack while I'm waiting so yeah this is gonna be so much fun and a nice tea party guys and you are invited I'm gonna be doing uh, lots of um, <clears throat> uh, uh, featuring lots of teas and again prepared in various ways and like I said if you have any request you know please um, you know let me know uh, Oh, I see some budding, right? Yeah, it's coming to loose. Let me know, you know, like send me some information if there's some teas that you want me to uh, preview or uh, to feature. Let me know uh, the teas. And I'd be happy if I can find them in my area. Oh, look at it. It's, if I find it in my area, of course, <clears throat> I'd be happy to uh, preview it on my channel or in, in, in this series. And you're welcome to send them also. Uh oh, look at it. It's flowering. Let me see. I have to clean this uh, off because it's steamed up now, but I would love to see it from the top. Uh, but it is flowering, guys. Look at there. Let's see. <laughs> it's coming along. see it's the um, the leaves are coming off you know coming alive let me move this out of the way Let's see if this will give a better background I might need to clean this top off because of the steam that built because I really wanted to <clears throat> view it from this <clears throat> sorry from this angle So I don't know how long it takes. It take it could take. Oh, look, more is opening. Oh, look at it opening. Oh wow. Metamorphosis. <laughs> yeah, because I don't know how long this takes. All you know, they vary. Depends on who makes it. Uh, it could vary from two minutes to maybe five or more or something like that. So I'm not going to disturb it. Cause I just want it to be very a very organic experience for us all. <clears throat> I don't know if I should have added more water. Oh look, it's coming a little more. I can't wait to see. Let's see what's kind of come open. Wow. Yeah, it's coming open. If you can see it at the, at the top there, it's opening. And I can see the water moving. 
It's very slow. I, I wish to do a, a time lapse with it. It's look how oh yeah, look at it. I can see the movement. You see that? Are you see that? Let me sit down because my hand is so jittery. <laughs> Sorry guys. <sighs> Let me see. I think my light is too too much. Yeah, look at it. You see that unfolding? This is really cool. I hope my water was hot enough. I just took it off and put it in the carafe. Yeah, there it is. I even see the bloom inside. Oh my goodness. I can see the bloom inside here. Down there, I think it's pink. Oh, it's pink, I believe. It's a pink rose. I don't. I don't think they tell you. I need to look on the website. But um, uh, no disrespect to Simpson and Vale, but the website is uh, sort of unuser friendly. It's not. But the the um, the catalog is really lovely, very uh, infor informative and and vibrant. But it takes a little bit getting used to to use the website. But I would love to. Uh, I don't know if they have the information on how to uh, how long it takes. On their website or not look at there guys you see that wow sorry for the light I don't know how is it I think it's coming off of my um, chandelier yeah I think that light is coming off of my chandelier let me see if I could move this a little Ooh, it's hot too <laughs> you see, it's, I think it's, is that moving or is that me? Oh, I don't like this one little light. Maybe I should unplug. Let me see if I can unscrew one of my chandelier lights. Give me a minute. Okay, thanks for waiting. Now it's uh, too dim in here. But yeah, so I don't know, is it finished? This, okay, some is still, it looks like it's still uh, going. And the good thing about it, I learned that you could use this, I think up to three times. Uh, most people use it in their flowering teapots. I don't have uh, a teapot. Uh, for this, um, I might put it on my wish list, but <clears throat> I don't think it's necessary. I just prefer this cup for now. I'm going to invest in another uh, cup of glass cups. I don't think I have any besides my Wessel or my tea punch, uh, <clears throat> my punch uh, cups. Wait a minute, is this? Okay, so this might be it. So let's see what we have. <laughs> okay. Okay. So this is it. This is the the flowering tea. I don't know if it should have. Uh, sorry about that. I probably should. Uh, now the one light is too much the on the um <clears throat> but i can see as you can see this is the um this is the uh bud the rose bud i don't know if it's supposed to open more but i don't want to keep you guys any longer but yet so this is the flower and this is the bud the budding of the flower so i think this is opened i don't know if this will open more but this is the uh, rosebud. <laughs> so that's the rosebud. Let me see. Let me smell it. <clears throat> it smells like green tea. I don't really smell any um, rose fragrance in it. I'm going to add a little honey. 
to it. Stir it a little. Yeah, I think that, look at that, it's really cute though. They, so they sew that into the uh, green tea leaves. They bundle them and sew them into the, to the leaf. So I don't know if I should drink this with this in here or take it out. Let me take it out. Yep, so this is it, guys with the little rosebud, the little rosebud. Looks cute, looks like uh, some greens. So I'm gonna taste this. Very hot, so I'm gonna drink it. I'm gonna spoon feed myself. Okay, tastes nice, tastes like a a green tea basically I don't really taste any any variation or any taste of um, a, you know like a rose flavor to it yet but yeah so this is the first of many what's in my cup tea party and you're welcome you're invited to this tea party <laughs> So I'm just going to let you guys go for now. I thank you so much for joining me for this tea video. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe and share and comment for more uh, videos. Let me know how you're liking this and whatnot. And tell me what you thought about the tea, this flowering tea. And if you had any advice for me, let me know because we can always do this again. And um, so just let me know what you think. So thank you so much for joining us today for my first What's in My Cup Tea Party. Bye-bye. Okay, well, I, I, sometimes I'm not going to say it, but I got to say it. This is your girl, Saida, the Domestic Handmaiden of Distinction, signing out for now. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.